Hello everyone and welcome back to some more RimWorld with our zombie survival. Alright, so we survived that raid, which was amazing. Now at this point, it's going to be all about trying to survive ourselves. Our guys are feeling pretty depressed, pretty unhappy. Things are rapidly going downhill. We've got the bedrooms somewhat up and operational. Roofs are just collapsing everywhere. Yeah, things aren't too good. We've got to get the bedrooms all cleaned up and back running. That's going to be the most important thing. Going to go ahead and make sure that uh, build a roof area is set here, not remove. I've seen I had some of that underneath remove. Just because of this. But uh, yeah, totally need to get this all situated. We want to get this armor put on here at some point. I'll probably go ahead and have me or Reven do that. Probably Reven. Reven has the flak jacket, but could put on the marine armor or the flak vest. We've got to pile these bodies up, get everything cleaned up, get set. It was a pretty brutal raid. Um, you know, back down to the trusty two. I honestly didn't think we were going to pull it off. I think we'll go ahead and let's see. He's going to install that lamp. We're going to want to install another lamp at some point. No, we probably don't need the two lamps in here. The, I haven't even had a chance to... Ah, here we go. We got an extra lamp here. I haven't even had a chance to uh, work on the power grid again for a while. So that needs to be worked on. Um, I will have Reven real quick. Let's see. Cleaning, building rubble, resting. You know, Reven, why don't you actually focus on getting that done and then clean both of these rooms? That way you guys can get a half a decent... Nights of sleep, and hopefully it'll help your mood just a little bit. I'm getting some rest now. Regardless, both of us have earned this. All right, that's enough cleaning, though. If you want to go to sleep, you can go to sleep. Just clean a little bit of your area. Not a bad idea. And get some rest, because I don't want you breaking either, if we can help it. Aesthetic is awful bedroom. My rival light died. Oh, Jesus. My rival banana died. Well, I didn't realize that you guys were uh, rivals. <laughs> so I guess that's the uh, silver lining <laughs> right there. <laughs> Extremely comfortable, though, so that's good. Observed corpse. Yeah, we got to get rid of that. How about you, my man? How, how are you holding up? Intense pain. Yeah, I forgot you got shot a couple times. Ate raw food. Hungry. Observe course. Uh, oh, my rival light and banana died. Well, hmm, Nara's master. Well, makes me wonder if there's a way to maybe tell if somebody's going to be a traitor. Wait. Reven is my rival. Oh, you know what? Probably because botch. Yeah, deep talk. Helped but insulted times 10. Minus 80. Botched my surgery. At minus 20. Okay, so it's going to take a little bit of working together to kind of turn that bad boy around. This steel stool is fine. We're going to go ahead and set this stuff up as well to be constructed. Actually, in both of these rooms. And my guy's up, but now he's going to rest, which is not a bad idea because it is early in the morning and he's a night owl. So I would like if he went ahead and got some sleep. He needs to rest up and tend to his wounds anyways. We don't want these turning into infections. Is there any guns? Let's see, we've got this gun here. But aside from that, I think that's it. Banana ended up going rogue on us. And uh, luckily did that outside. So that's what kind of protected us. Okay, Reven's up. Going to do a little bit of hauling and then probably going to go ahead and have himself a meal, which will be good. He's playing chess right now, which is fine. I just want his mood to stay up. What can I do to help you, Reven? What can I do to make you happy? Ratty apparel. Well, that would help. The Sin Thread pants. Well, you can go ahead and put these cloth pants on. There you go. What else could I do? Observed corpse hungry. Well, you're going to go eat, I'm assuming. Oh, no. You're not going to eat. 
Do I only have rice? Banana was our cook. So... Why don't we go and have you cook a couple meals and then you can eat that. You'll feel probably a lot better having some meals. Um, oh crap. Yeah, I forgot about that. Wait, I don't even remember how that happened. Well, let's just let Reven cook for a bit and we'll deal with it if it becomes a problem. It's not technically a problem yet. I'll wake my guy up in the middle of the night. He can go deal with it. Ah, oh, he's getting hungry though. He's going to have to get up anyways. Yeah, I want Reven just to focus on meals for a bit. There we go. I'm up. Consuming simple meal. Not a bad idea. Reven, have yourself a meal once you're done. Hey, look, a little bit of pleasant chit-chat. Oh. Oh, no, there's another one. We know there's another one. Don't get bit. That's the last thing I need right now. Excellent. All right, we better go ahead and patch this up with some sandstone since we've got... Well, we've got a lot of granite laying around. We've got sandstone too. You know what though? Let's patch it up with granite. I just want the outside wall to be stone eventually. All of it. I don't care what it takes to get it there. As long as it gets done. Um, he's going to go rest some more. I actually wouldn't mind if you hauled that. And... Am I happy with the Zestava? I think I am. Whatever whatever happened to your, your weapon though? I don't remember. I dropped it. But where? Because I don't want it to go bad. The PDS was actually a pretty good weapon. It would be deadly in the right hands. I have no idea where. All right, we got some potatoes going. This is also going to be a potato field. Transport pod crash with cra uh, crash with a relationship. Uh, a glitter world empath named Poopy. <laughs> oh, why? Named Poopy is crashing in a transport pod nearby. How did that name even... If she survives the impact, she will be badly wounded. Poopy is from your enemy. Vanamine's revolvers. You can capture her for recruitment or slavery. She has a relationship with the colonist. She is Reven's mother. She's an enemy and she's Reven's mother. And she's kind of far away. We could save her. It would probably take me going out to do it. Uh, Reven could do it. Reven, you're going to go save your mother. Let's go. I have full trust and confidence in your ability to pull this mission off. I hope. Okay, perfect. Let's just move. You can clear them out later or I'll wake me up. I'll wake good old Sabouts up here and I'll have him clear them out. Makes a little bit more sense anyways. And Reven's a good shot, I think. Yeah, shooting nine. It's not excellent, but it's enough. I got to get these two, the G36C and the M4A1 SD. Those are weapons that I'd like to bring home. All right, Raven, right there's your mother. There's there's Poopy. God, God bless you, Poopy. God damn. God bless you, MJ Poopy. Bleeding out in 14 hours. Let's take a look at her health real quick. She's been stabbed. Okay, in the left leg few cracks here. She's got a stab scar. This obviously is not her first stabbing. Um, all right. Yikes. No shooting and no melee. She is a medieval lordling. Construction mining. Good social. Glitter world. Empath. Medical plus two. Social plus eight. Hunting disabled. Finishing off disabled. She is incapable of violent. She is greedy and she is a slow poke. But she would make an excellent just around the base servant. She cannot do anything at all in terms of defending the base. And that makes her terrible. But that's a really good social. and could potentially let us recruit some more people. Plus it's Reven's mother. Plus pretty good medical. So she could be a doctor around the colony. Um, 
when those other people are fighting and she can do some research and she's got a passion for it. Yeah, we're going to grab this person. Need a prisoner bed. We can go ahead and just throw something up in here or I can go ahead and work on that real quick. And Wells, I'm working on that. We will get... Let's see, are you gonna... You might not live. I'm gonna start carrying it to the crypto sleep casket, which is what? In here. All right, I was hoping that it would kind of lead me closer while I was building that bed. Well, at least put you there. We could just throw up a temporary sleeping spot, I guess, just to do the healing and such. See, I can't make it for... Let's see, capture. I can't, though. I cannot. Until I have the prisoner bed. All right. Hang tight for a second. I'm on it, anyways. I could just drop a prisoner sleeping spot in here, but we'll just get this bed up. That would have been the way to do it, actually. There we go. At least we could have started getting her here. I don't even know if she's going to live. Sad Wanderer. Milky has broken down his wandering around. Milky, you're still... <gasps> Dude, we can actually save Milky still. We're going to go We're gonna go get Milky right now. We could throw him in this room and make it a prison. As soon as Reeving gets back here. But let's go check on Milky real quick. Now, Milky might still be in some rough condition. We don't know what uh, Milky's situation. Oh, damn it, Reeving. Let the zombie munch on your mother a little bit. We don't know what Milky's situation looks like. He could very well have been had the crap bitten out of him by zombies. Okay. Yeah. Oh, 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 I was not I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. I guess I should have been expecting that. But I was not. Milky's not even that good of a shot. Well, we killed him. We killed the we killed the damn bastard. Sorry, Milky. I, that was not my goal at all, but I guess I'll go ahead and grab your shotgun. Oh boy. What a shame. Go ahead and cancel that too then. And uh, when you're done, you might as well grab that rice. Uh, you're going to bleed out. You actually should probably get some medical help. Just get the shotgun there first. Reven, um, if you need to tend to Poopy, it's a pretty big deal. Or Poopy's not going to live. I cannot wait to change that name if this person gets recruited. I cannot believe that I'm going to spend the next few episodes calling somebody Poopy. All right, we want to reduce resistance. Oh, there's my uh, P90SD. All right, I'm going to go ahead and rest. I'll have Reven here take care of me when, when she's done with, or she, he's done with Poopy. Um, yeah, that's fine. Now, uh, yeah, I guess I can rest, rest. Reven's going to get some sleep, too. Not a bad idea. So we'll start uh, reducing the resistance on Poopy. Like I said, not really the best character. A lack of violence is not ideal in our circumstances, but somebody who can just do mindless things around the base, always useful. Um, and I'll end up changing the name, first and foremost, and then we'll, we'll have... Uh, Good old Poopy here go around. I mean, I could keep it Poopy too. <laughs> we'll have him go around and uh, oh, we got to get this wall repaired. Um, probably deconstructing stuff, working on the tree sewing because that's a pretty big deal. Uh, getting that research done and some other research. 
heat wave. Okay, so we're gonna wanna go ahead and turn that off. And we're gonna wanna build an air conditioner. Oh man, what else? Yeah, I think that's it. Poopy is no longer incapable of walking. My wild man wanders in. Nice. So we could go arrest a wild man. I can't see him, but we know he came someplace in this side of the map. Somebody gave me an excellent idea of going and exploring the map by like sections, so I might do that. Kind of start with one section of the map, get it all explored, and then move on to another. Because we, we've still got a lot of exploring. I think this would be the most explored area still. This one's really... Actually, no, this one probably is because we've explored inside this entire building here. Because of wandering. We just haven't done these ones. Bunch of animals asleep in this one, actually. I don't remember if there's anything in here I wanted. The wooden plate armor would be interesting. A lot of herbal medicine I wouldn't mind. There's wood in general. Um, M27 IRSD. I think I found a room full of guns, but I don't remember where. Oh, plus the healer mech syndrome. And we're still looking for a bionic leg for me. And we still have to go get that other vanimetric power cell. I'm just kind of waiting till I have a place to actually put it. All right, so Reven's up now. Reven, I'm actually going to have you go ahead and refuel and cook at the campfire. Because we kind of need meals. Maybe if we get Poopy recruited, then Poopy can, <laughs> God, Poopy can focus on that. Um, I want my guy to sleep throughout the day if he can. I don't want him getting up. What is the temperature inside? It's pretty warm. So actually, why don't you work on the cooler? So that way we can get that. Um, we can take care of everybody in here and get that wrapped up. Someone turned into a zombie. Let me guess, Reven. No. Dimitri turned into a powerful zombie. What? What does that mean? Oh, Reven, honey, where are you going? Hauling steel to cooler. No, 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 there's better, better places for steel. You need to figure out what this Dimitri garbage is. Okay, phew, I thought that's what it was. Need to do a little bit of investigating. Oh, oh. Oh my god. I figured they were dead. They were just dead. I didn't think that they could turn. Okay. All right, we don't want to... <laughs> We don't want to mess with that right now. We'll mess with that in a minute. I don't. I really don't want to mess with that. Get the granite wall done. Get the freezer done. Then we'll mess with Dimitri, the psychopathic zombie. Oh, wait. I... There. Fleeing. Just get inside. A little bit of granite right there. Who's up? Oh, I thought I was up. I thought I heard a door. Ah, damn it. Don't hit the solar panel. We got to get those repaired anyways. Uh, 1,500. I'm going to get my guy up here in another hour, I think. Good job, Reven. Like I said, once you're done with that, you're going to go work on the freezer. Whatever steel you need to use, my man. Are we low on steel? No. How much have we got? 500. Oh, no. That's 648 steel. Plenty of steel laying around. Not a not an issue. Not an issue. Do we have components? We do. We got some advanced components still too. There we go. 
And uh, 70, we'll turn it down to 66. And we need to deal with the prisoner's room too. Reven's cooking more meals, which is fine. Time for me to get up and get some work done. So we can take care of the prisoner. Make sure they're being fed and stuff. Who Who's the best at warning? I think it's me. Social. Yeah, definitely me. Days. Poopy went to days and I went to days. All right. All right, we'll just let it, we'll just leave it alone. Damn, I already had minor malnutrition too. Hopefully Dimitri stays right there and doesn't move. I figured it was only a matter of time. Probably should have just left me in bed. Ah, uh, okay. Well, Reven, once you're done resting, then we'll go ahead and finish the vent. And then I don't think I'll end up leaving the base, so I should be safe. Still got to get that flak vest, too. There's so much crap that needs to be done. We're, like, just barely getting by. I miss having four people. I can't even get out to explore or grab the weapons or, or uh, medical supplies I want or get the vanimetric power cell with everything going on. Plus, I want to set up the new stockpile area. I'm, I decided I'm probably going to end up putting the stockpile area here next to the comms console. So we'll put the trade beacon down here. It'll be a nice area for it. I'll get rid of this wall. I actually probably got to just go ahead and remove the roof from this whole section. But uh, I think I've already got ignore roof area. No, yeah, I'm going to want to I'm going to want to remove the roof over this whole area, but I'm not going to worry about it just yet. Because Reven is busy. Reven, why don't we go ahead and work on the vent so that way, once I snap out of it, I've got a place to rest. And then we'll have you get some food so that way I've hopefully got a place to, or I've got some food to eat too. And then I want to get all these metal pieces hauled out of the rooms and stuff. I think they're, yeah, they're really bad for beauty. So we're going to make a stockpile for that while Reven's in the process of harvesting. He's got to harvest too and keep the crops going because if we don't let him do that, things are going to get out of control. So we could do a stockpile or a dumping stockpile. Um, probably just store all of the stone and metal slag and crap right here. It's not really an area that's high trafficked. Um... If not that area, probably in here. But if that zombie, if that zombie wasn't in there, I would totally do that. Let's just like do right here for now, just to get rid of the metal crap. No corpses though, just chunks. Chunks that I set to be hauled. That will set all of this to be hauled. This won't get done probably for a while. What's wrong with the Nara? She's got the flu, that's right. The immunity's winning, but she's super malnourished. I was just gonna say, I was like, she hasn't gotten up in a while. Well that would be that would be why. Reven, can you feed her? Tend and feed, because you could do both those things. Okay, so that should be fine now. And you've been fed. You have not been fed. Oh, being fed now, good. Oh god, I'm up, okay. Wow, really bad though. Hopefully that catharsis can keep me afloat. Advanced starvation. It's all it's all pretty ugly. I'm not gonna lie. My man, you got a bed, you better use it.
Perfect. All right, Reven, it's probably going to be your turn to break, I'm guessing. Ah, you're holding in tight. Even even though I'm slave driving you, you're working right in there. That's good. Playing a little chess, good thinking. After you're done with that, I'm going to have you do the steel dresser and the lamp and this real quick. Cause just because I know that will keep you fairly happy zombie attack. Okay, on the edge of the map. Why did I hear something breaking though? A lot of zombies moving out there. You can kind of you got to get an idea for how many zombies there are cuz you can see all the footprints. Moving right along. Hey, Anara, you're up. And hopefully going to get some of your own food. Oh, do not go near what's-his-face down there. That would be a terrible mistake. Oh, we got to check on Poopy, too. Mad Buck. All right. That's fine. Doesn't really affect us. Somebody needs to be doing wardening. And handling, yeah, sure. But definitely wardling, uh, wardening. That has not been getting done. What the hell made me go down? Extreme el Yeah, extreme starvation. Oh, Jesus. Reven, get up. You gotta... What the heck was that? You gotta rescue me, my friend. And I guess feed me. All right, how am I now? It's gonna, it's gonna hang out there for a bit. All right, I'll just rest till a lot of these gunshot wounds and stuff are done. All right, Reven, we're basically just counting on you at this point. It's pretty important that you don't let me down. Also, I need you to haul this. Okay, I guess I'm back up. Okay, solar flare, it's fine. Oh, really? That vanimetric power cell, though, is not enough? No, the solar flare ruins all electronics. That's right. Boy, solar flare and a heat wave, that's a bad combination. All right, Poopy, sorry you haven't been fed in a while. Guess you're not really that important. Okay, my guy's going to do a little bit of recreation. Hey, we got visitors. Awesome. They'll hopefully clear our front door here, and then we can get out there and grab that flak vest. That's what I ultimately want. Um, okay. Resting. Uh, well, we gotta fight that zombie. We can't haul this body till we fight that zombie. Um. All right, fine. Excellent. All right, Reven. Anything else here? Observed rotting corpse. Yeah, but I can't. I got to get rid of that. I know. But it's kind of tough because there's like a super zombie next to the corpse. Po oh, wait, wait, wait. The super zombie's gone. No, it's not. Reven, wake up. Anara decided she's going to go fight the super zombie, so now we have no choice. Oh my god, Anara. Why do you do these things? Oh, Anara pulled it off. She killed Dimitri. Okay, but needs to be healed like right away. Death in seven hours. She'll head right for her animal sleeping spot. Then we can deal with it. This person wasn't bit, were they? Bitten off, bitten off, bitten off, bitten off, bitten off. The right eye was bitten off. God damn. 
All right, I'm gonna have my guy go and tend to an R right now. Um, don't worry about using anything. Just stop the bleeding. What is happening out there? Holy crap. Oh, the heat wave is over, so that's good. Those visitors can't possibly be happy about the whole ordeal. Solar flare is ending. Perfect. That'll cool the whole room down some. All right, time for me to eat and then get some stuff done. Hey, there we go. Uh, hopefully that guy wasn't bitten. Looked like there was something going on there. Yeah, I'm probably not getting over there to that visiting grave. Aw, the grave of uh, banana. Poor banana. And then feeding some rice to Poopy, that's a good idea. Forever gonna get any of that recruitment done. And then I gotta have, Reven's gotta focus on making meals the next day. Reven, that's gonna be like your goal after you're done playing billards. And yeah, it's not a bad idea to clean that room a bit. Oh, you know what? We gotta put a door up. We gotta put another door up, I didn't realize. Resting. Why don't you go work on the door real quick and then you can rest. Let's make this room a little bit nicer. Look, you even had a pleasant conversation with Reven. That's always good. Got to work on that, uh, that, <laughs> that opinion after all, after Reven like cursed you out. Who the hell are you? Independent wild man. How do they keep wandering into here? Zombie bite. Oh my god, 129 hours to become a zombie, and that's on their torso. They will be a zombie regardless, but how did you get in here? That's unfortunate. Oh my god, that's unfortunate. They would have been great. Undergrounder, great memory, misogynist, but that's all right. Tribe child, cave tender. Look at this like well-balanced list. Not great at shooting, but pretty good at some other stuff and a lot of passion tickers. Um, we can't even help them. They, they've got the infection. Unless we made the dra uh, the drug lab, which we don't even have. Fire, so, melee attack. Hmm. I guess we'll just hope they wander out of the base and don't turn into a zombie in base. It's at 129 hours, I think. We got some time. All right, Reven, get that last potato there planted. Yeah, finish that roof. And then removing roof. Why? Was I going to remove roof over this whole thing? I think I was. You know, though, Reven, what I'd actually like you to do is prioritize cooking. Um, that really is significantly more important to me. Got to get that new kitchen up. That's going to require us getting this done. So I think I'll have my guy go ahead and start ripping this floor up so I can get my little kitchen here all set up. But we you know what? We'll save that for the next one. We're out of time. Been an episode of just trying to recover from the raid. It was pretty brutal. We're not even close to being there. There's blood everywhere. Still needs to be cleaned up. We do have Poopy here, though. Hopefully, we'll get them recruited, get some meals up and running. I'm going to get this floor torn out so I can get a kitchen slash butchering area up, and then I can reposition the freezer like I want to. We can get this farm finished. And uh, what's what's the next big thing on a list? I don't know. There's a couple of stuff. Probably getting another room up here because chances are, if Poopy does join us, we'll hopefully be getting up to a fourth person again real soon. That being said, though, thank you all for joining me. I hope that you've enjoyed it. Look forward to seeing you next time.